What's up guys? Um welcome back to another video. Um you know subscribe if you want, comment, like. Let's get into it. So today um I wanted to talk about kind of just Zuba, you know? Just the state of the game, what my you know, my opinion about it, you know, what I think's good, what I think's bad, what they should do, what they shouldn't do. Um yeah. You guys agree you know you can leave a comment saying yeah i agree you know if you disagree just tell me why in the comments but yeah so the first thing i wanted to say was zuba levels like character levels so right now the max is 19 and it was 18 like it was 18 like for like a month ago when they changed it to 19 or something i don't know but anyways but so when i started playing zuba back in like early 2020 late 2019 the match was 16, and it was, and it was like that for ever since it came out to, uh, you know, until like the update 3.0 in like 2021. I mean, it was level 16 was the max for literally ever. And then with update 3.0, they changed to 17. I was like, okay, some new content, that's good, that's good. Um, and then it was changed to 18, um, what, like August? I don't even know, it was earlier this year. Like the middle of this year, some I don't know, I don't know, something like that. But no, 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 earlier than that, like May, yeah, May or June, let's say it was 18, I don't know. you know. And I was like, okay, it's, it's getting higher, but I was like, you know, they probably should stop here, right? And then they dropped level 19, and I'm like, you know, like just stop for a minute, but we don't need new levels. You know, we don't constantly need a new character. Just let it sit for a minute, you know, just. Well, you have a good game right now, just, you know, just kind of leave it, you know? I mean, it's like, how, how paid to win do you want it to be? But, like, seriously, people spend so many years, you know, grinding, grinding. Hey, I finally got one max level, and then they raise it. And then they raise it again. But it's crazy how when Zuba first started, all the way up until 2021, I forgot exactly what month, it was level 16. And now they're dropping new levels, like, like every, like, five or six months like that's literally no that is way too much but um yeah so that's my opinion on that um yeah i mean i feel like right now it's it's fine level 19 i mean it's fine because also the higher it is that means new players are like level 20 is a max and i'm a level one while well, i don't play this game you know like i was outside level 20 because i'm assuming they're gonna drop down a couple months you know <sighs> but anyways Next thing is um, the items. Um, they're, you know, level 12 now is the max. Um, it used to be level 8. And level 8, I pretty much had all max items except for... And I've talked about before. So let me go back to around 2021. Where there was a whole nother tab. So you see the store, characters, and clam right here like that. There was a whole nother tab that said items. And if you got, like, let's say healing canister, you were able to use that for every single character. There wasn't different items for every single character. But anyways, but before that, the, I mean, yeah, before update 3.0, the, all the items, the max was level 8. Um, and then a little after 3.0, actually, um, like a couple months after that, they changed it to 12. And that's actually, I, I'm fine with that because, you know, that was another thing you could kind of grind for. I like that. So I'm happy with that, you know, that's good. Yeah. Next thing is um like this setup right here. So when they introduce deathmatch, it stays in squads, and that's fine. And they got rid of solo light, and I'm really also happy with that. Because 50 people is not enough. Like you literally can't do anything. So solo full and standard, fine. I don't mind them swapping. But duos and trios, like why can't they make it to where there's duos and trios both available at the same time? I mean, like, there's been multiple times where there's three of us and it's duos. And they want us to sit out and, like, and we can't play squads because then we get two random teammates. And we don't want a random teammate because if we're playing high levels and high trophies and then we get destroyed because two of our teammates are trash, like, because they're level 12 nixes that just can't, like, like, you know, we can't, we can't win. We're just gonna lose trophies. And also, when you have two people and it's a trio and you get a random teammate and they're not good, then it's like, you know, we can't do that either. So, they had trios and duos both available, you know, that would be amazing. But yeah, 
No, that'd be good. Um, you know, I think the mission system is pretty good. You know, they're never too hard. So I like that. The battle pass, they changed the rewards like, you know, like a couple weeks ago. Um, or actually like a month ago. But anyways, but like, I think the rewards are, you know, it is all free stuff, so that's fine. At the beginning, I don't want a gold two bucks. Make it like, make, give us like an emerald crate, you know? I mean, that, that, that'd that just be nice, you know? Because they do give us a gold crate and a free skin, and that's nice, but, yeah. Um, events, you know, rank always been the same. It's fine. You know, I like this, this new system of events that came out like three months ago. I like it. I think it's good. Um, you know, in the update, like, well, like two days ago, they added this. Because it used, used to be you go to profile and there was a friends tab right here in the top right corner. Um, and now it's a whole different, like, section. And that's fine. You know, your code doesn't, it stays right there and you have add friends, you know, stuff like that. Here's your request. But anyways, it also used to be where every time you click on friends, um, back, so in your profile, you click on friends, you click on your, um, add friend, so you can see your own code. It, every time you did that, and then clicked off and then clicked on again, the code would change. Now it's at least the same code, you know? So I'm happy with that. Um, yeah, so that's that. Um, now with map changes, like, I do like, uh, my favorite two map changes every year is Halloween and Christmas. Because obviously Christmas is just amazing. Halloween, I like the map change. But last year for Thanksgiving, I don't even know if they did a map change. It might have changed a little bit, but other than that, you know, it's not nothing amazing. But anyways, so um, another thing I want to talk is how often they drop new characters. Like, it used to be where back in, you know, 2020, 2021, we wouldn't have a new character for months. And that was fine because I wanted to focus on getting my other characters upgraded. But now, you know, these are the only two characters I don't have right now. But, um, yeah, it used to be where every, you know, five months they, well, maybe like four, yeah, they get a new character. And that's good. But now it's like every, like, two months, you know? And it's like, that's just too much. I mean, it's always good to have new characters, but right now it's like, you know, because also it's harder to grind because uh, I mean, next, when the season resets in like, uh, yeah, a day and nine hours, um, I'm just gonna, what I usually try to do is grind to get all my characters GM1. And then my favorite characters are the ones I'm better at with, like I'll try to get GM1, GM2, um, yeah. But yeah, it's like, that just makes it even harder for everybody to grind because there's new characters that you have to play with and yeah, I mean, I still, I'll, I'll like new characters, obviously, but, you know, it's like, come on. Anyways, so another thing was here with events, you know, I, I was wondering, well, not wondering, but just a suggestion for the Zuba team is, like, maybe towards the end of the season, I don't mean when our event tickets expired, I mean, right before the end of the, like, Zuba season ends, like, you know, one day and nine hours, that one, um, they should, like, put everything on sale. Not, not by a ton, obviously, but, like, this, there's 30,000 now, maybe it could be, like, like, 25, and this could be, like, um, you know, like, I don't know how much percent off that would be, but it still, it helps us out, you know, and this would be, like, you know, like, 14... Just be like, you know, like 9,000 something, you know, like that. Um, I think that'd be nice. It, it's easier for people to get rewards and stuff, you know. Because you should try to help out the people who play your game, you know. I mean, they're, they're playing your game, you know. It's not like, I mean, you know. It's, but, but also, I've been loving how there's things in the shop that are for gems, like offers, like character skins, obviously. And we have 753 gems right now. But, um, yeah, it's, it's been amazing, you know. I can't buy anything, but still. Also, this is not a wish I had 20,000, but... <laughs> I don't. <laughs> Anyways, um, also, like, little off... Like, Zuba. Not every single offer has to be $100, $70, $40, $100, $20, $20 is not too bad, but... 15 for a skin, like, that's literally insane. 
Hundred, 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 hundred. Nine dollars for that's not a great offer. Um, they were that. But like, these offers like this, where it's like five dollars for a Chris. I don't have five dollars right now. Um, yeah, that, that's that's like really low amount of money. But it's still, it's still something, you know, it still rewards. <coughs> and by three for seven, that's not too bad, you know. I would actually do that. Um, as I said, I don't have any money right now. Um, added to my phone, but um, yeah, like uh, you know, I mean, I might get it better later today. We'll see. I might get the ammo crate. But yeah, like you know, things like that. I don't like it. So that's pretty much all I wanted to talk about today. Um, but yeah, I'm probably gonna drop a video later today of me just you know playing a game with some characters and um try finishing out this event you know i'm only pretty much one game away and another 50 minutes is when i'll be able to play again and there's no point for me to claim my missions i'm not buying the pass because it's ten dollars for a one week even though the season is two weeks if they sorry zuba another thing you made the season ten dollars or like sorry the if you made the pass Ten dollars for two weeks. I might do that every now and then. But ten dollars for one week, you have to buy twice. That's twenty dollars two weeks. Like that is not worth it. That's forty a month. Times that by twelve, and um, that's four hundred eighty dollars. That's literally four. Like that is way too much. My math is probably wrong, but that's that's the way I raise. But yeah, I'm trying to get like top 10 on this so I can get that I haven't gotten any of the emotes so I'm kind of mad about that but anyways another thing I want to show you guys the personal so I was doing the warrior of the day thing with Jade and I got 200 kills 75 30 and 15 and I would open these right now but I'm gonna wait until it's reroll and I suggest everybody does that with their stuff because like I'm not trying to diss on Frank but I hate Frank he sucks like he's terrible he, he's I consider the second worst character in Zuba Yara's even worse but yeah Frank's a little better than her yeah Frank sucks maybe he's probably a little better than Ollie but yeah other than that and I will want to get tokens for him you know so I'm just gonna wait, wait till reroll for all that and I will record it open opening it for you guys so you guys can see what I get and stuff but yeah Thanks for watching the video. Um, yeah, just let me know your opinions down in the comments. And yeah, have a good day.